Hi, Pickman County. This is Dr. Kimberly Levin. I wanted to take a couple minutes in this video to explain the Johnson & Johnson vaccine, answer some common questions. Uh, we are so fortunate in Pickin County to have received this vaccine this week after rapid approval this past weekend by the FDA and by the CDC. Um, the Johnson & Johnson vaccine now adds and we have three highly effective vaccines to combat this pandemic. So one of the first questions is, is it effective? And the answer is yes, the Johnson Johnson vaccine is highly effective. The most important endpoint in a vaccine is critical disease, severe disease, death, hospitalization, and it is 85 to 100% effective against uh, this endpoint. Um, you have heard that the effectiveness may be a little less than the Moderna and Pfizer. And honestly, it's like comparing apples and oranges. They were done in very different populations. The Johnson Johnson trial was done later when there were more variants and it included South Africa across three continents. So you really cannot compare the three. However, if you look at the overall effectiveness of Johnson & Johnson in the US arm of the study, which included almost 45,000 people, uh, it's 72% effective. And this is highly effective against mild and moderate disease. Uh, and so the vaccine is a success and I uh, recommend that you get it if it's offered to you. Um, the other, the second question is, is it safe? What's the safety profile and the side effects of this vaccine? And it is very similar to Moderna and Pfizer. Uh, it causes a mild flu-like, it can cause a mild flu-like illness that includes fatigue, uh, headaches, myalgias, which are muscle aches, some people get fever, and, um, the most important thing is to know that these are uh, side effects. They're short lived. It usually disappears after a day or two and that you are not infected actually with the virus itself. This is just an immune response and it will be short lived. Um, and uh, there uh, was only one person in 45,000 people that had a more serious reaction and it was easily treatable. So yes, this is a very safe vaccine. Uh, third question is, does it have advantages over the other two? And it absolutely does. It is a single dose vaccine. It's one and done. And so for people who are working and it's logistically difficult to come back for a second vaccine, it's highly effective. You get one dose and one shot. The other advantage to it is that it is easier to store. It only requires refrigerator temperatures. And for this, it's logistically, it's more of an agile vaccine. It's logistically easier to get into um, kind of uh, smaller communities to increase equity and access to being vaccinated against uh, COVID. Um, and so those are its main advantages. Um, so overall, uh, vaccination is really one of the most important ways to protect yourself against disease, against this virus. You're also protecting your friends, your family, and the most vulnerable in our population, in our community here. So uh, it is one of the most effective ways to get a handle on this pandemic and um, I urge you all to get vaccinated. And now that at this point in the pandemic, vaccine supplies are low, I urge you to get any vaccine that's offered to you. They're all highly safe. Um, they're all safe and highly effective. Thank you very much.